Hello guys, what's up and assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to Smart Programmer. I hope you all are fine and today I'm back with a new video. In this video, we are going to create a mini project uh, which is very useful in real life. So which is a phone number module in Python or how we can locate our phone number or validate our phone number in Python language. So without any further delay, let's jump into the main video. So now we are moving on to the installation process. So first of all, we have to install this phone number library. Okay, to install the phone number library, we have to open this terminal. Okay, now we have to type here pip install phone numbers. You can also do this on command prompt, but I'm doing this on terminal. pip install phone numbers. And make sure that you have an active internet connection okay now just press the enter button it will take few seconds to install this library so our library is successfully installed and you can see here successfully installed phone number okay guys now we are going to import the phone number library in our program so for that import phone numbers Okay. okay, in first step, what we are going to do, we are taking the string of phone number and then we will use a method and it will uh, extract the phone number plus the country code from that string. So it's a just, it is just a one line code for that. I'm taking a, a variable called as number is equals to phone numbers dot parse. Parse is a method which will extract the phone number from the string and I'm passing here a string. So now just please make sure to give a correct country code. Uh, right now I'm giving here 92. This is the country code for Pakistan and give uh, any random number but it should be correct. 0, 4, 5, 7, 8, 9, 0, 2, 3, 5, 6. Okay, this is the phone number which is in string format and now just print here. Print and give pass here the number, right? So now let's run it. So it is giving us the country code which is 92 and the national number which is this, right? So this is very simple and very interesting project. Okay, now let's move on to the next step. So in next step, what I want, I just want the region of this number plus the service provider of this number. For that, I have to uh, import to other method of this module. For that, from phone numbers, import geocoder geocoder will provide us the name of the region and another uh, carrier carrier will give us the name of the service provider right so what i'm going to do i'm just taking here two variables number one is region r-e-g-i-o-n region i'm using here this geocoder library geocoder dot description for the number right and just pass here the number this number because it will work on or manipulate this number to get the region comma english specify here the language plus now i'm taking another variable which is like service provider right and i'm using here this library which is carrier dot name of the number and uh, sorry pass here the number comma language en right so now just print service provider and then print region right let's run this program Okay, so Mobilink is the service provider and region is Pakistan. So this is absolutely right. There is nothing wrong with this information. Okay, guys, now I'm going to play with this module a little bit more. So now I want to validate my number, whether this is a valid number or not, and check also its possibility. So for that, do nothing else, but take another variable, which is valid. Use the same library which is phone numbers dot is valid number. Use this right and pass here the number just. It will check whether the number is valid or not. 
and same for the possibility so take another variable which is possible and then use the same library possible phone numbers dot is possible number right and pass here the number and now let's print these two variables so print valid sorry valid and print possible so let's check it yes this number is valid number it is giving true and this number is a possible number because this number is 11 digit number in which is the possibility or and which is the standard number in pakistan so 11 digit number is the standard number in pakistan that's why it is giving us the true in both conditions okay guys you can also get the time zone of the number by using the time zone library so just import here time zone right type here time zone right so make sure your variable name and the predefined function name should not be the same so i am using here the capital z to make it different from the library name which is time zone sorry time zone time zone for the number and pass here number now just print this time zone variable print and time zone let's run this program asia and karachi okay asia and karachi so this is the time zone for this number Sorry guys, I'm not feeling well, so that's why my voice is not clear in this video. So please, uh, sorry for that. Okay guys, so there are a lot of other function of this uh, phone number library. So please go and do it by yourself. And also, and if you like this video, please give a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for more videos. So, so please support my channel so that I can create more amazing content for you. So bye for now. Take care and Allah Hafiz.